So I never went to college. I never went to a four-year college. I didn't even go to a two-year college. I went to school, uh, well, college for like on and off for like maybe two years, did a little couple classes here, did a little bit of working there. And so I never got the famed three seconds where somebody handed me a degree that I might not even ever use. Yeah, instead of doing that because I knew that I wanted to go into a creative field, I just spent my time attempting to perfect my craft. Now, I won't say that that time spent in school amounted to nothing because I made some wonderful friendships with buddies that I'm still friends with today. And it's kind of like if you take the trail of why when I went to college, even though I didn't finish to now, I literally wouldn't have met my fiance if I didn't go to college, even though I didn't finish. But I thought it would be fun to make a degree for myself. Now, Elliot, did this maybe some of you guys are familiar with Elliot and I don't feel as bad for stealing his idea because when he did that video he made it in Kittle and we have even more templates than we did then and we have more features and more functions and the tool is just better overall he was using some templates I believe if I remember the video correctly but I think that we're going to try to make something more from scratch something a little more me and unique just to show you some of those templates, these ones are pretty cool. That one is very official looking and doesn't look like anything that I would ever want on my wall. That one's very cool. This one's nice, looks like a, a certificate of uh, doing like a UI UX course, best dad ever, that's pretty good. Comment down below if I should edit this with my dad's name, print it out and give it to him for his birthday this year. Not just a certificate, along with a bottle of bourbon, of course. Well, those are really cool, but like I said, I want to do something unique. So I'm going to start a new project. I'm going to change my units to inches, and I'm just going to do an 11 by 8.5. So like a horizontal sheet of paper. Excellent. And so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm definitely going to give it that lovely off-white color. Can't have no stark white degree that's just never how they look you know can't be doing that do this nice off-white color down here and every single degree i always see a wreath like a laurel wreath know how to explain it without just showing no not that one of these yes something very like this that's cool that's cool that's cool I do love this one. I used this for a merch design that I did a couple of videos back. So I'm gonna place this somewhere around here. And you know, since I, I don't like, since I work for Kittle, maybe Kit, this can be a degree from Kittle to me, made by me and given to me by me. So we're gonna do the official and famed Kittle College. This is Blind's audience. I think this is a newer font that we have. Get that nice gold color. Lovely, lovely gold color. Size this. I think like something like that just looks very, very pretty. Very pretty and professional. Very, very nice. Okay, next step. It definitely needs some things on the sides, like some nice ornaments. So we're gonna go to elements and we're gonna scroll down until we find, you can also search for this, but I just like finding the category. Is it ornaments? Yeah, it's the, in the ornaments. We've got some flourishes, Victorian flourishes. This is pretty cool. What if I put this, got some cacklers outside. Put this somewhere like here, that's sick. It's almost like a, like a, almost like a trident, I guess. You know, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna use this one because I believe that I could put this in each of the four corners. Option, drag, and then hold shift to make it stick along that path. Flip it and then do that. And then I'll do the same. I'm gonna group these together and center them. Option, drag, and then we can flip them vertically. Ah. I already feel myself getting more smart, like as if I had a degree. Maybe we need to move this up 
a hair to give some room. So I need something to go around the edges. I'm a little bit more minimalist. So there are these ornament frames and whatnot. And you know, they only work the best when like it is the exact aspect ratio of what you're doing. But I want something a little more simple than that. So I'm literally just gonna take a square and then stretch this out so that it has the same space on all four corners. Get rid of that color and then just add a border. Boop. And now my design feels like it has a house to live in. It's very like Victorian, almost kind of collegiate though. I like the collegiate like 90s tennis court kind of vibe from this. Just get the positioning of this right because that's crucial. That's crucial. So we're going to copy this down here and we're going to say Kittle College. We'll put that down here at the at the beginning, at the bottom. See, I didn't go to college, so I don't even know how to speak ornaments. We're gonna get like a nice ornate underline here. Size that down. That's looking nice. Something like that, nice in line with that bottom line right there feels really nice. I do need a nice line to uh, put my signature on it so I'm just going to grab so you can grab this line but my experience with that is it's difficult to size it this way so it's easier when you size it left to right and then make it skinnier as opposed to having it start skinny and then trying to size it left to right is just like it's it's very infuriating cool text. Let me do this. AI Copilot. This is in beta, so we're going to try this out. Give me generate text. Formal. A couple sentences that congratulate me on completing Kittle University. City. Yes. Congratulations on completing Kittle University. Let's do that. And we can't use no roboto. This needs this is this is this is formal. So we need a we need a serif font for this. Something like that looks collegiate. Something like that. Like I want it to be also nice though. Like I want it to be professional, but also like kind of trendy. I do like that. Boop. Nice uppercase. I'm gonna embellish this as if this would ever happen. All of us here at Kittle are so proud of you and your accomplishment. We are excited to watch you become the world's greatest designer. Start a petition to have like a onboarding process like where at the end of it it gives you this and it has your name on it and then i like having that boxed in something like that and then my name would never be that big see this is what i'm talking about is like you have to zoom in to do this luckily i've got time because i don't have a real job to make that line like shorter ungroup that boop Bop signature. Bop. And then we could do like, I wonder if, I don't even know if we're, can do like date. And I don't even know if we have to. But for the sake of time, I'm not going to actually write my signature in here. We are working on a pen tool. So if we already had that, I would do that. But pen tool is coming soon. And you can watch me revitalize my self-given Kittle College degree with the pen tool signing my name. You, can, you guys can all attend my graduation. That'd be really cool. Let's do something like this right here. Graham Wilson. Ah, beautiful. It's kind of funny. Like, I want to move the text box that says signature so that my signature can go below this as if it's dependent upon that. 
wonder if we make this spaced out, like really spaced out, and then make it smaller. It makes it feel more like, ooh, you know. I'm gonna select all of this and bring this up. And I think I am going to add a date and professor make sure that i don't actually size that like up you know i'm gonna do something like this bop then i can group these command g center it up do date and then prof and we're gonna just copy this text down here. And what's today's date? Eight. Comment down below if you still have to count months on your hand. 08, 23, 24. What a lovely day to graduate. And then we're gonna do Tobias Saul, the owner and founder of Gill. Sweet Toby. Let's see, should I bring this down some? Oh no, let's not select everything. Cheeky little border weight changing colors on me. Oh, I see what's happening. Okay, I think I'm very, very happy with this and I'm ready to receive it. Here's my degree. Thank you so much for bestowing this upon me. I've now graduated and I have, I have it. I have my degree now, thanks so much. And the power is now truly in my hands to become the world's greatest designer. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. Well, that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, like and leave a comment down below. Did you go to college? Did you go to college? Did you not go to college? What'd you do? What are you doing with your life? That's, that's the question. This is what I'm doing my life. I'm making YouTube videos for an in-browser design tool. That's what I'm doing. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, stick around, watch a couple of other videos. We've got some amazing, exciting features coming to the platform. We know that you'll love it. See you guys in the next video. Have an awesome day.